And there we go. <clears throat> now it may not be a winner, but it's certainly a chicken dinner. And all that remains to do to that is put my award winning gravy, which is famous in these parts, in the correct location, which is here. Drizzled. Over the meat. Superb! Now, the only thing that hasn't come off that plot is the carrots. As I said before, um, everything else has come off the yin yang. So we've got the um, cauliflower, the broccoli, or calabrese rather, uh, the French beans, the potatoes and carrots which we mashed together. So we've got a couple of um, King Eddies. And three carrots. I think there's three small King Edwards and three carrots that were mashed together, and the remainder of that of the um, parsnips were all boiled up, mashed together to create that. And there's your chicken, which is um, one of our mates' chickens that we had, that we got. Uh, that was done in herbs and, and butter and things like that as well. And it's gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous that. And um, I'll show that another time, actually, how to create that, how to roast the, the perfect chicken. And then the uh, new potatoes are there as well, which were the um, jazzy and charlotte. So there's a jazzy and a charlotte there. That's a charlotte and that's a jazzy. The little cauliflower, that's off the plot. The, uh, the um, parsnips were off mixed plot which are the honey roasted parsnips and um, yeah I'll show you how to make gravy as well one time how to make the perfect gravy or what we think is the perfect gravy as well and uh, that's all to come so I hope you're enjoying the channel hope you're enjoying the show hope you are enjoying our organic journey uh, oh yeah the peas yeah I've got peas there as well peas are off the plot that's the last of the peas we got about 25 pods yesterday, and that's the last of them. That's not all the last of them, obviously, but because um, we got, out of the 25 pods that we got, we got about knocking on for 200 peas out of it, and that's what we've cooked up with the rest, with the French beans uh, and carrots on that top tier of the steamer. So, yeah, happy days. Thanks very much for watching. Hope you have a cracking bank holiday weekend, this August bank holiday weekend. It is the 26th of August, the Sunday. Tomorrow we're going out, we're having a fantastic time uh, in uh, Rivington. And we're going to see the Chinese gardens, we're going to see the Wizard's Tower, we're going to see uh, all these old Victorian follies that are made to look like ancient buildings. It's like Lord of the Rings, Rivington. Go up there, it's brilliant, absolutely brilliant. But yeah, I hope, you, I hope you've enjoyed this little um, update. Because this is what it's all about. You're growing your own food. And you're eating it. You don't just leave it in the ground to rot, do you? Get it eaten. So goodbye from Big Daddy Farmer. And farewell from the little farmer. Who's now asleep because he was knackered before anyway. But as, as you probably saw in the earlier um, sections of the video. But yeah, so he's going to be woken up any time now to eat his tea and then he'll probably go back to bed again and uh, dream about skateboarding and whatnot. But uh, yeah, thanks very much. Have a cracking weekend. We love you all. Get commenting, get subscribing if you're not already a subscriber and join the growing revolution. My name is Guru Mafinda. Happy days and I'm having me tea. See you later.